and welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. I've been picking rocks like crazy. I have a ton of flint and stones. We are ready to do this. I killed a couple fish. I almost got killed by a pack of piranhas that caught me off guard. Uh, we are going to do, I think, energy. My energy keeps running out picking those rocks and it's a pain. So we have eight points. Oh, really? I thought we were going to get nine. I guess we had an extra moon. Alright. Well, we definitely want to get this one. <sighs> that means we're going to have to kill some more stuff to get that one. Oh, I really thought we'd get nine. Okay. Well, luckily for us, there's like a bunch of dodos here. So we're going to go kill some of these guys. Here's a male dodo, level three. Goodbye. And we're going to switch the axe because we want some hide. Stock up on that stuff. And then let's go on another one. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> Look at that, it's so efficient. Actually, I did kill a turtle. I should mention this. I decided to go after one. Well, two. The first one, it was okay. And the second one almost killed me. <laughs> uh, but my spear on the first one did not break, and I stabbed it so many times. I don't know if they changed it or not, because I'm going to show you after one second here. Kill this last one. How much a difference? They used to, like be very very random sometimes you get four or five hits they'd break sometimes it break instantly this is level one dodo so is he gonna come at me no it's gonna run that one wasn't very effective but see you can actually harvest two with it okay I said it had a meat bonus is there another dodo around here but yeah I'd sometimes lose a spear just poking a dodo so it's not like it was a turtle and it had a hard shell, it was just kind of random. Okay. Oh, there's a couple dialos. Go after those guys. I thought there was one more over here. Apparently I, uh, I extinguished- oh look at this rock! I didn't even realize this rock. Look at that. I, oh, look at that. Can we make it? Oh, we made it. Is there anything in the water if you hadn't made it? No, not really. They're actually adding in a new dinosaur, which it well, not dinosaur, a new creature. Oh, there's a megalodon. Um, oh, that's a bright colored one. Look at that, nice bright orange. Um, it's like a, I want to say it's like a dolphin, and you can actually tame them, and you can put a saddle on them and ride them. They're like the beginners' uh, version of a water jet ski. <laughs> you kind of like just hold on to them for dear life, and then they just go. There was something killing something over there. I don't know what it was. It was probably a Dilo. Let's go after these two. See if we can get them. And then we'll go home and make. Don't. Oh, you got me in the eyes. Got me in the eye. Um, we'll go make that mortar and stuff. It's very expensive. So I hope if you're uh, kind of done it yet, it takes a lot of stone. I want to say 96. Let's check. Uh, crafting. No, 65. I was off. But 15 hides and 65 stone. Luckily for us, this actually has a decent amount of stone just sitting on the ground up here. I don't know why. I guess because it's so rocky. they just kind of fallen off over the years. But yeah, it's a very good spot. I'm kind of liking it. Okay. Check, make sure there's nothing nasty in the forest here. Looks pretty clear. Food, uh, the water, we'll just wait. That's the next thing I want to increase. I usually don't ever increase food, because you can always eat and bring more food with you. But water is limiting. Like, you can get water skins. But the trouble is, for some reason, like, say you just wanted to top off a little bit. They drinks the whole thing. So rather than, like, half of it, it drinks all of it. So, it's kind of annoying. Okay. My fire is invisible again some meat off of it. Uh, we'll put some more wood and stack some more meat in there. Light that puppy back up. There we go. So let's see where's my rocks. <laughs> I got 170 flint in there plus I got another 100 flint in there plus 190 rocks. Wow I've been busy. Okay let's do this. This you have to also um, you need a foundation to put it down. There we go. All these rocks, and look how big this thing is. <laughs> it's a little 
odd the resources that you need yeah it's this big <laughs> that's a lot of rocks I had to pick up for that now can I even get in this thing I might work on building this so that we can actually get some more experience oh look at this just nice and fit okay can't do anything but all you do is you throw it in there and we'll eventually have recipes we can use to make some stuff um, narcotics can we do that in the next level we could that would also be very handy we could use the spark powder to get some experience points and that that would be nine points so we could do that because otherwise we're getting into the wood now the wood foundation and the wood walls I'm almost level 10 actually so we could get in some nice goodies there gunpowder as well oh choices alright well we have some rotten meat and you have some extra meat on you let's do that let's prepare to make narcotics they're also very handy for taming dinosaurs the only downside is it takes a while to make them it basically it takes five narco berries and a rotten piece of meat so I have plenty of meat cooking I've already got plenty of meat on me I'm gonna put some of this back on him uh, there we go so what I like to do a little trick is because this meat stacks and only one of them will spoil there's a little trick you can do which is you split the stack and then now each one of these stacks is going to spoil at the exact same time so all you do is you keep separating these um, if you hold shift and drag it splits the stack in half but if you hit control and drag down here it says this you can split one piece off the trick is just to keep holding it if it's a little touchy if you let go of the control before it's almost done it will cancel it out <laughs> That's why some people have troubles with it because it's very touchy. And now all these pieces of meat, they're all going to spoil in less than a minute. So that's the best way and easiest to get your rotten meat. And this stacks up to a hundred, so you know it takes a while before you actually get a whole stack. So let's throw all this in there. Uh, I got food. I got spears. I got the mortar. So we need almost 70 uh, experience points. I think we're gonna go kill some more stuff. I'm gonna take this off. I'm gonna leave that cooking. If it spoils, it spoils. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're just you're just a nasty little group. Anyone level up? No. Okay. Oop, I'm dehydrated. Good time to go leave. <laughs> Pop a couple pieces of meat in our mouth. And let's run with a spear, because that's always safe. Now I saw something down here. I'm not sure. That turtle, by the way, if you've been watching, it's always there. It's because it's stuck. That happens sometimes. They get stuck in the trees. Is there anything nasty in the water? I want to say it was either Mega Piranha or could it? In fact, oops, I guess we're going in there. Oh, oh shoot. Um, it could have been one of the new fish. Luckily, this is kind of shallow. There it is. Oh. It's a dodo. <laughs> I thought it was a fish. It's a dodo. It's bobbing its head up and down in the water. Okay. We'll end your. S oh my goodness, you flew so far. Come back here. Alright. There's a turtle. I don't know if I want to mess with a turtle. It used to be you could, like, just stand and run around behind it and poke them in the butt. I've never had that luck. They always turn around, like, super, super quick. That's a parasaur. That carnotaur is still over here. I saw it when I was leaving. Alright. So our health's doing okay. We got some spears. I'm almost tempted to go across this beach because there's like a bunch of turtles over there I've been eyeing. Like there's a bunch of turtles over here. I think we're going to do it. I don't see the carnotaur. No, I don't see him. Let's do it. What level is this guy? Oh, he might have gone over here and tangled with his uh, Bronto. You're level 4. I don't have enough spears. I don't feel like making a bunch of spears. Oh, shoot! Three turtles? We're not going to tangle with all three of those. There's one in the water, though. Dilo. Oh, what was that? I saw a tail. Could be a stego. I've never really been on this side of the water. Oh, there's a Spinosaurus. <laughs> That we will definitely not... Oh shoot, there's a spinal right there. Okay, running, running. 
I thought I saw a tail, and I was like, it could have been a Spinosaurus, but it was really, really big for a Spino. That is, in fact, a... St I mean, a Stego. <laughs> I'm too, uh... Oh my gosh, that was close. Oh, we're out of here. We are gone. Um... That was scary. Okay, <laughs> I knew that tail. They have a very kind of a uh, spiky tail. So I should have known that was his. The spikes weren't going the right way. Okay. Is there anything over on this beach? <laughs> oh. Cool little rocky area. Okay, here's a turtle we can go after. Anything in the water? Probably not. Fish don't give that too much experience. Those little guys, they're as bad as parasaurs. They are quite quick uh, when they want to be. Okay, so we have to run. I'm checking for Mega Piranhas. Okay, what level are you? Level 3? I could take you. I like that black. Looks nice. Make sure there's nothing out here before we... Oh, what's he fighting? Oh, he's fighting a... He's fighting a raptor. Let's go assist. Yeah. Oops, I missed. Yes! Go away! Go away! <laughs> oh my goodness! I didn't expect him to come and turn on me. Oh, he has loot. Let's grab our spears before they disappear. I was trying to get him in mid-air, though. Uh, inventory. Ah! Ooh, we got an arrow. Oh, no way! We got another pike. That's amazing. Okay, we're gonna take... We're gonna take this all. Oh, that was so cool. Now we just don't want to die with both pikes on us. That would be horrible. Oh, I can't believe the luck with that. I've never got in that pike that early. And then I got two of them? Okay. I think we can definitely take on... Where'd that turtle go? There he is. I think we could definitely take on this turtle. If I have to, I will use my pike. It does quite a bit more damage than uh, these spears. But yeah, you just... You come up behind the turtles. Wait, 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 wait. Make sure there's nothing else around here. Well, there's one raptor. There's bound to be another sometimes. Alright, we're good. Uh, oh, shoot. There's not run. That's level 16. Where'd he go? Is he down here? That would have been horrible. Level 16? He would have ate us. Chopped us up and making us into soup. Okay, here we go. This is the one. Level 3. Okay. So he used to be able to poke them in the butt. But look how quickly he just... Whoosh, he like jumps up in the air and does a 360. Or 180, I should say. Yeah, he just keep backing up now. And just keep headshotting. Oh, shoot. Don't go near that other turtle. I don't want to fight him. But they have incredible range too, so don't underestimate them. And I should be actually hitting oop, hitting this guy. I just defecated. Whoop. My computer keeps doing that today. I don't know why. Whoop. Whoop. Okay. Come on, die already. We're getting we're getting close to that Spinosaurus, and I don't want to get this close. They are quite fast on land and even faster in the water. Let's double check. Nope, he's not there. Okay. <laughs> now, these guys, you want to get with an axe. Because they have this resource called keratin you see up there. And it's more likely to drop when you use an axe because it's technically part of their hide. Um, and you want to stockpile that. Because if you ever want to fly one of those things, their saddles cost 75 of it. And, um, let's see. You can get it from turtles. You eventually can get it from this new creature, Trilobite, I think it is. But it's not in the waters yet. Um, you can get it every once in a while from a Triceratops, but not very often. And it's a lot of work in the beginning trying to kill them. Um, a lot of work. But if you want to, kind of stockpile on that. Of course, it takes a lot of experience points. I want to say it's 20, 25 level before you can unlock that recipe for it. But just stockpile on it. It's kind of a good thing. You're level 16. We're not going to go after you. I'm going to just uh, drop this since I already have an extra axe at home. And I don't need that one. Because we got this other one. And I'm kind of tempted to go after this little piggy guy. This is what we got a saddle for. They're kind of cute. But um, they're not the best. They're very weak. And um, I mean they're they're a pack horse. That's basically what they do. What level are you? 14? No, we're not going to tango with you either. Let's see if we can get this little guy. He drops a lot of meat. Did all that spoil yet? It did. Look at that. 15 meat. So let's see. This is going to spoil. 
Let's divide this up real quick so that it can spoil and we can get lots of narco berries later. There we go. Okay. He's getting a little farther away. If he runs in the water, that'd be best, but I bet he's not. Well, he might. I'll try to aim. Up. Oh, oh, and see the serpentine. Serpentine! Don't run in the raptors, please. Don't do it. Where are you going? Dilo. You gonna go in the water? Thank you. Oh, well, you just. Gotta... There we go. Oh, shoot. Oh, that's so cheaty. How can you climb that, but I can't? Oh, you little bugger. Can I get on this side? I can't. Oh, now you're in the water, but I don't know what's in the water. Dive, dive. Any piranhas? Nope. Okay. Let's see if we can catch this guy. I need to eat. Okay, he's coming back to us. Let's eat a bunch. Throw a spear or two. You can throw spears while you're swimming. I don't know how it works, but it works. Now we just gotta keep poking them, and there we go. Switch to our uh, pickaxe, get our spear that I threw and missed. There we go. Breathe up, get a little air. And collect our other spears. There we go. Throwing spears. Very nice. Okay, we're getting a lot of meat from this guy. Air. You don't. Oh, don't want to run out of energy in the water. If you run out of energy, you can't swim up to the surface and get air. You can't uh, swim faster. That Dilo is still trying to come after me. So be careful when you're harvesting stuff in the water not to overdo it or attack things. Because you will drown. Okay, there we go. Get some hides, got some meat. Doing good. This is a good hunting run. So uh, let's take out this Dilo since he just wants to come at us. And then we'll maybe go after that other piggy. Come here. Right. Oh, you still got me in the water. You. Okay. Pick up our spears. Okay. Oh. Thought I heard another one. Okay. Oh, uh, he's in the water too far now. I don't want to go that far. You never know when a piranha is going to come up and get you. you go after this guy. He might run into the water. He may not. What level are you? Level 8. Hmm. What about you? Level 9. That's even worse. Look at this. It's another little rocky. Could hide in there. What's that? Oh, another parasaur. Let's just check the beach real quick. Make sure there's nothing out here that's going to kill us when we're trying to kill something. Okay. Are you stuck? I think you are. You're stuck in that tree, aren't you? Oh! Oh! Just poke you then. There we go. Go get my spears. Where'd they go? Oh no! I'm going to have to make some more spears. Oh wait, there it is. I think the other one got stuck in the tree. Yep. Ooh. You can almost get it. There we go. Thank you. I <laughs> jumped on his back. There we go. Got over spears again. Whew. There it is. I'm almost out of food, though. I am actually out of food. Um, I think we're going to go home. Drop off one of these pikes. No sense taking two to the grave. Oh, there's another turtle, though. This is where I get in trouble, though. Try going for something, <laughs> and something gets me. Okay, what level are you? Another gr oh, 19? No. Nope. Not long enough spears for that. Okay. Oh, oh this is Triceratops. It looked like he was fighting something. Nope, he just must have fell off that rock a little bit. Okay, we're good. Always look around. If something's fighting something, um, you always want to see what they're fighting, and then you want to see if you want to stay around to watch, or if you want to book it, because it may be your only chance. Okay. What level is this Parasaur? I could go after him, maybe. The trick is my hunger's going down. When your hunger is out, you start uh, losing health. Same with thirst, and if you lose both, it's even worse. 
Plus, your energy is a lot worse to uh, regenerate. Oop! We are out of time. Oh no! I didn't level up. All right. Well, it's getting dark, anyways. So, I am going to t go home, unload some of this meat, um, set some aside for cooking, and um, I'm going to probably kill a few more things. I might build some more structures, just get experience points. But next episode, we're going to go and try to plow through. See, he's still stuck. Um, we're going to try to get a bunch of experience points by using that mortar and pestle, which would be very nice. We don't have to run around all episode trying to kill stuff and try to avoid combat where we don't want to. But I will see you guys next time. Bang.